Hello guys, welcome back to another reaction video here on Our Eyes Your Eyes. I'm ready to watch episode 21 of A Platinum End. But before starting this video, I just want to remind you to subscribe to the channel, click on the notification bell, leave a like to support me and join me in this adventure. Okay, there are a few episodes left, uh, three except of this one. And let's see what's going to happen now with Mirai and all the others. Uh, I can't wait to see what's going to happen. Are you ready to join me with this? Check it out. Uh. I don't know. I still feel suspicious about him. I mean, about the police officer. I don't know why. <laughs> Who's this? A Yoneda? Okay, the professor. Mm -hmm. Why? Wow, even the prime minister? Oh no, no. Oh. <laughs> the stadium, guys. Do you remember? They were saying this even in the previous episode. Yeah, it's better because you will never know. <laughs> Oh, he is also connector, I mean. Ah, oh, no, okay. At least everybody can see this discussion. <laughs> Why Nasa is not replying? <laughs> Especially after we know that Nasa has a great role here. Well, at least we, we can try to go over there and see what's going on. <laughs> oh, hey, come on with these red arrows you want. Oh. Yeah. What the F? Yeah, he shot with the red arrow all those people and now he's testing on them? Yonida. What the simple F? Yeah. That's why you see how people can be influenced so easily, yeah. Uh, until you show them that they can believe you, no, but later, yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
You'll see. I don't think it's an agare ball, she's sincere. <laughs> no. E in fact. <laughs> Let's have this a private discussion. <laughs> Saki and Mirai. Ma it's not a cliche if you really believe it. Huh? But if you reveal your wishes, they are not going to become true. You should have not said them. Yeah. Wow, this is scary. Wow, they went to Mexico. I mean... Uh... Oh! Mira, I didn't answer. I mean, I didn't say anything. No! Yeah, but you didn't say I love you too. I mean, oh, what the F? <laughs> Where are all the others? Okay, it's time to go, Mirai. You go. Yeah. No, I mean... Oh, yeah! I think... Yeah. Wow. That's true, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh! As I was saying, it's like as if he's on another, I mean, he's, the, he's not belonging to this world. Yeah. Mm. 
No, I think that he's going to change his mind, y'all. No, I think that you you are too confident right now with your thoughts. You can't expect that that boy is now changing his mind. Oh my! Then... Oh! <laughs> okay guys, another episode finished. I was waiting for this meeting, but I have never expected that even the police officer was coming to try to convince Yoneda, but at the end of the day, he couldn't. Uh, we see that Yoneda is focused on his thoughts only, and he can't uh, listen to other options because he's pretty convinced that everything is like as he says. That's uh, the typical stubborn person who can't change his mind. And I was uh, thinking, yeah, when the police officer was confronting him, uh, yeah, maybe he could have found a way to touch his heart uh, somehow, but it's quite impossible. So I think that Mira is right by saying we can't convince him. Uh, even if we try, we can't because he goes on with his principles. And in this case, when uh, mm, science is on his side, he can't stand other options because science can be proved and other options can't because they are just thoughts and we all know that Yoneda is thinking about his thoughts thanks to numbers, thanks to evidence so there is no other choice but I couldn't imagine that Mirai was saying what he was saying I mean at the end he is saying that they have to kill him <laughs> because there is no other choice I don't know if Mira is saying like this because he is going ahead satisfying somehow Nasse because at the end of the episode you see Nasse that he, she's smiling and she's saying Mira, like, Mira, let's go, let's do it as if she is controlling all the situation anyway so I don't know, is Mira doing something like this to think that by doing something like this Nasse can be satisfied so he's just trying to convince Nasse that he's doing this thing but on the contrary he will do something else or he's he just uh, convinced about his words and uh, they are going to kill Yoneda in the next episode. Mm, I don't know what to think uh, at this point uh, but the only thing I know is that 
I agree with Yoneda when he's saying that those angels are something mean. Yeah, I don't trust them and I don't think that it's something good that one of them is becoming the god. And I don't agree that some of them have to risk their lives because one of them has to become the god. I still hope there are still three episodes left and then that's it, but I still hope that nobody will become a god. And at this point, nobody will have the chance to reflect their vision of life on others because that's how you can influence other people's lives. Okay, what Mirai was saying in previous episodes that he doesn't want to influence people, he wants that people are experiencing their life based on their thoughts, yeah, etc, etc, yes. Anyway, by imposing your will, by wanting that everyone is becoming happy or that everyone is searching for the happiness, etc, etc, anyway, is a sort of imposition. That's why I hope that nobody wants to become a god because as soon as one of them is becoming a god, that means that there is this influence coming on all the world, no matter what, no matter if it's a positive thought or a negative one. So I prefer at this point what Yoneda says. We don't need a god and there shouldn't be a god ruling on others, especially because this god is coming from a human being, so even worse. But I don't like what Yoneda says regarding how to end all this. I mean, by saying that he wants to kill all the god candidates. No, I think that if uh, they could have found a compromise by keep talking without uh, killing uh, one another, I think that would be amazing, but I don't think that this will happen, so <laughs> we just have to remove this option from our mind. Last but not least, uh, Mirai and Saki together, when Saki was saying I love you, and Mirai, thank you, no! I thought that he was about to say I love you too, actually, but no, it didn't happen, so sorry Saki! You were friend zoned, maybe. I still want to understand what Mirai wants to do. I don't think that he wants to kill him. Because after he killed the Metropolitan, after they were killing Metropolitan, Nanato killed him actually, he's still thinking about Metropolitan. So I don't think that he wants to do the same thing. Maybe it's just a way to trick Nasse. I hope so at this point, because I don't like her. Uh, no matter how cute she seems, maybe it's a devil reincarnated in this great physical appearance, but then she's a pure devil. And, and then I say to you another thing, because Yoneda is, as I was telling you, too convinced about his thoughts that he's not even thinking that maybe the boy next to him, this other god candidate, can change his mind. Because suddenly he was saying, oh, I was thinking about the uh, uh, end of my life, but uh, I'm not too convinced about this anymore or something like that. I mean, from that sentence we understood that maybe this god candidate is changing his mind about ending his life or not. Can you imagine if something like this is happening? I mean, Yoneda is convinced that that god candidate really doesn't have any problem to end his life like this but after all these boy experienced thanks to events thanks to even that dinner for example maybe he is starting appreciating his life more than before so things can change from that sign too Let's see. Let's see what's going to happen next week with episode 22 of Platinum End. In the meantime, feel free to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bell. Bye, guys. See you in the next video.